Hey guys, welcome back. Chat Night Paladin. Please click on this video to go over to the first part where I did the lights and all that jazz. So this video is the coloring part and the background and this also a long video but yeah I did spend a lot of time here doing the shadows and the highlights and trying to get the colors right and yeah I had a lot of fun though even though it did take more than a week to finish I'm still sick so I'm sorry I really can't talk that much this time so again the music Sorry, it's like really shaky. Um, in reality, I'm just zooming slowly up and down, but since this is on super speed, it's really going over the place. Next time when I do a stream, I might try not to zoom in out so much. Yeah, I'll see if I can fix that in my next few streams. So this fluffy part of the cloak was actually pretty fun, even though it did take somewhat a bit of forever to finish. I'm really proud of how it turned out. Um, it's a lot easier to do with watercolor. Um, if you've watched the video before this, that is the Saber, uh, Fate Stay Night Saber panel that I did. It's really a lot easier to do that fluffy effect with watercolor. But the fact that, the fact that I managed to pull it off digitally, I'm pretty proud. So 
so we're working on Lindo Amamiya now. Um, yeah, my favorite character in the game. You may know why he's my favorite character in the game if you watched some of my videos already. And you know about my weakness for pretty boys. <laughs> Um, okay. Ugh, man, I hate this cold. It's currently the flu season. For some reason. It's the burn month, so why is it the flu season? Ugh, jeez. My throat hurts like hell. Also, I feel like recently when I draw digitally, the way that I color codes have has gotten really better, especially with the folds and highlights and shadows. Even the way I draw or the way I render skin, I feel like I've improved lately. Um, maybe I guess if you've watched some of my older videos, especially the character designing one, I did mention that I was having some difficulty with anatomy. And that this ha this tends to happen to me that before my style improves or before I manage to fix a problem, I go through this really rough patch where I know something is wrong but I don't know what's wrong. And even if I try, if even if I find out what's wrong, for some reason I have a dif I have a difficult time trying to fix what's wrong. And then one day it'll be like snap everything's okay and much better than before so um, when I first started uploading videos to YouTube I was going through that phase unfortunately uh, which isn't really that good of a start for me I guess but I feel now that that phase is over I feel like my my style in general my process the workflow is better I, I'm not sure what exactly is different but I'm not I'm, yeah, I'm better now than I was a few months ago. I hope this could, I hope I managed to keep this up. Um, that I managed to keep up not being lazy when I draw, especially with digital works. Um, that I, because I have a tendency to get a bit impatient when I draw digitally. I don't know why, but I have a tendency to get a bit impatient. So, I usually skimp on the background and some details, but that's what I've been trying to fix. Um, I've been trying to make sure that I don't use too much shortcuts in the sense that I'll just cut corners to finish the piece. Because that's honestly not a good way to draw. You're sort of shortchanging yourself and in the end you're not always super proud or you're not really super contented with what the product turns out to be. And that is really one of my weaknesses, and I've been trying to fix that. So I hope with this 19.4 hours um, recording and drawing session, I hope I was able to achieve that and maintain it for the further pieces to come. So now we're, we're working on the backyard, which is called the den. It's where all of the god eaters go to for missions and supplies, and it's where you spend pretty much half the time in the game because it's pretty much your home base, and you go back there after every mission. And the den has this very industrial, um, but very still warm vibe to it because of the yellow windows and the lighting of the place. So I had to fix the lighting on the characters when I was done since I guess it's one thing I need to fix in the process because a lot of artists that I watch on YouTube or just watch and know in general 
have a tendency to start in the background first and I see why they do that but it's not really a priority for me which is probably something I do need to change since it would help me avoid things that would slow me down like this where the draw where the background comes in last so I have to go back to the characters and fix the lighting on them now depending on the piece that could be a real Rescap of everything with the lighting or in this case I just had to overlay some color fix some of the color on my avatar and it worked but I could see why it could be a problem in the future so that's another thing I need to work on so we are the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed I know it's a super long video, uh, please click here or click in the description, it's there also to go to the part where I work on the lines and the sketch face and follow me on Tumblr Instagram DeviantArt and I'll see you around.